According to Finance Minister Dr. Ashni Singh, the government has recognized that there are anomalies and disparities across positions within the public service salary scale. This result in some inconsistencies in the payments received by employees at different agencies, particularly among those who are similarly qualified. To illustrate the inconsistency that has been identified, Dr. Singh explained that a new graduate with a degree in environmental science might be earning $120,000 in one agency, while a new graduate with the same environmental science degree might be earning $190,000 in another agency. Both of those graduates may be providing the same services, yet their salaries are different. And so, Dr. Singh said that the government will make suitable adjustments to employees' salaries to ensure that the payments received are more consistent. Provisions for this, he said, will be made in the 2022 national budget. Your government has recognized the existence of a number of anomalies and disparities across positions within the public service salary scales, as a result of which there are marked inconsistencies across the pay received by persons holding similar qualifications but occupying different posts depending on the agency in which they work, the post to which they are appointed, and the salary scale in which their post is classified. Commenting on this during a subsequent interview with the newsroom, the Minister of Public Service Sonia Parag explained that the government will be investigating the public service to determine where these inconsistencies are. When that is done, she assured workers that the government will work to raise the salary received by the individual receiving the lesser amount. Using Dr. Singh's example, that means that the graduate earning $120,000 would be able to earn $190,000 like the other similarly qualified graduate. Then generally the public service is guided by job descriptions. Right. So if your job description maybe has functions more than another job description in the ministry because of what the ministry's mandate is, then perhaps not, right? right? So um, we have to, again, look at something like this very holistically. I want to take you back And to that is where my role will come in. Parag, however, pointed out that increasing employee salaries will have financial consequences and will require the government to assist the availability of funds. She also noted that the public service is guided by job descriptions, which may mean that similarly qualified people may be providing different services. As such, she said that the matter has to be assessed in a holistic manner.